Hi, this is George Tran. I just want to show you um, my latest toy. It's the Li Live Scribe Pulse Smart Pen. And uh, this is what you get when you open it up. I just got it from Costco. This is what you get. You get the, the box. You get two sets of uh, replacement pen cartridges, as you can see. Uh, the pens are rather small. It's really surprising. When you open it up, get this tiny little package. And here are the pen cartridges. Can you see that? They're tiny. Really, really small. Tiny. So you can't, it's going to run out pretty fast. So I don't know how much the um, replacement pens are, but it's not cheap. So again, I bought this from Costco yesterday. It comes with two um, packages of um, ink cartridges. It comes with five um, books. You have to get special books, you can't just get the a regular um, notebook, it doesn't work. And the package that it came with from Costco has five of these books. And the books are really special because it has these little dots that is a matrix. And you can't see it, but it's a tiny little dot that actually um, gives coordinates of the screen um, for the pen. So it's pretty cool. Um, the other thing that it has is of course the pen. Here it is. Be sure to charge it all the way up to full, otherwise it might not work properly. I had a lot of problems syncing with it, my PC and I had to leave it overnight and it works great. great. So it comes with a pen. It also comes with this um, headset that you can put in to record. The amazing thing about these things is it actually has a built-in microphone as well. So that when you talk, it actually records things in stereo. It works really well in a, in a lecture hall or, or a conference when you want to record a conversation, it works really, really well. And a good, good, good quality headphones and good quality um, reception. So highly, highly recommended, good product. Only thing is this head, it's not a standard uh, jack head. So you can't just plug it into your iPod, for example, or into your uh, microphone. It, it's a special head. So it only works with the pen. And you, do, you, you plug it in just like that. The other thing is, this is really cool because it t there's a uh, camera at the end of this um, unit. It's hard to see, but there's a camera there. And that camera is pretty smart. You can use it to, for example, type. You can use it to set the time. Use it to do a, a calculator. It's got a built-in calculator here. You can't, you can't see, but you can tap in the numbers, multiply, add, and it will calculate and it will show on this display here right there and you can um, set the time check the battery status and all that on, on this um, inner cover of the book like so so I'm gonna give you a demonstration of the, the product which um, really impressed me and uh, I can see myself using it a lot for business in days to come so stay tuned actually I forgot what you do is the, the pad has these little controls. I forgot to do it. So over here you can tap on record on the, on the pad. You can see where is it? Uh, over here. All right, so you can tap on record, pause, stop, and jump forward, jump backwards, and um, you can scroll back and forth on the record. So I'm gonna do that again, and I'll show you what I mean. All right, so I'm gonna start doing that by doing a record here. And I'm going to write, hello, again, this is George, this is a square. And now I have to stop. I'm going to click on the pause. And the amazing thing is, now when I click on replay, for example, I can click on this. And now I have to stop. I'm going to click on the pause. And it replays. So, for example, if I go in here, I click on that. So it knows what I said at the time I said it. Hello. Again. 
game. And, and now I'm going to have to stop. I'm going to click on the... This is a square. So it's pretty cool here, but it's more impressive. And now I'm going to have to stop. I'm going to click on the... It's more impressive when it gets transferred onto the computer, and I'll show you how to do that later on, on, on the, further on on this um, tape. But it's pretty cool. You can just write it, scribble, and the important thing is to remember to verbalize and talk about your diagram. This is really good for a, a training situation where you want to draw some diagram and you say, over here I want, you should do this and that. And then this type of script will be displayed in real, played out. Um, as you write, as you speak, uh, it'll be displayed on the computer and you can upload, upload that onto the internet and I'll show you how to do that later. Okay, so now I can go click on a word in a place. Hello. I can click on square. And you notice here, it will replay everything as if I typed it in real time. So it's, again, it's really handy Hello. for a training to co train some concept or when you're doing collaboration, you want to say, I want this changed, I want that changed. It's a pretty good tool for that. But this is really cool. Check this out. On the top, there's a search screen. So let me move the computer so you can see it. So over here, there's a search function here. And the search, I type in up here, George, and it highlights George in the text. So let me show you what I mean. I had a previous document and I had a word on it called Superman. So I type in Superman. And you'll find, let me go back, sorry guys, I wanted to zoom it so you can see, but it's, it found the document containing my handwriting of Superman, right here, uh, Superman, see that, Superman, it highlighted it and found it from my handwriting, my so that was my chicken scroll handwriting, but it found it without doing anything by typing this in the search field right up here. Right up here. So it's pretty cool. And then what you can do is upload this entire thing to their uh, public website called um, Live Scribe Online. And then all your friends can get access to this uh, demo as well. What I would uh, do for my business is to use this in conjunction with Camtasia and Camtasia is a screen capture program and it will capture all my notes and um, then be able to replay it as a, a tutorial or demo online streaming uh, for people to see. So it's a pretty cool product. Uh, after a few initial glitches, the, the syncing was, was problematic and it still is somewhat problematic but overall I think it's a pretty handy tool. You could use it to, for example, um, illustrate parts of the body. It would be great for children, for example, if you drew a, a face and you say this, this is the eyes, this is the nose, this is the ear. It also would be great for, for example, if you want to do a translation. For example, if you wanted to translate from Chinese Mandarin to English and vice versa, if you touch on the nose and you, typed in, you, and you spoke it in Mandarin, it will... Um, basically be a visual very quick translation tool without having to be a fancy graphic artist so many uh, general applications it's pretty cool especially if, if you're a, a marketer a trainer and you want to train people on concepts and ideas you can scribble it on, on a uh, piece of paper and then put it onto Camtasia so it's pretty cool hope you like it um, let me know what you think take care bye